Yo, I'm Josh from Job and Joshua's History Edson Reviews. Today I got something cool from eBay. It is a dual HDD or SSD drive slot for Mac Minis that are 2010, 2011, 2012 models. And it lets you add a second hard disk drive or an SSD drive into your Mac Mini. I'm having trouble cutting this open, I apologize. Um, it's a weird box. But it comes with um, the logic board removal tool, which you'll use later. The SATA disk reader ribbon that will go into your SSD or HDD, the second one, on the bottom or top, whatever you want to call it. And a whole bunch of screws and a little bit of rubber to like keep things from smearing and smashing into the plastic uh, caddy for the hard drive or SSD drive you choose to use. And it looks like everything's here in this weird little packet of stuff. It's really odd. And they left a little note for you, a really nice note. Um, and it also has uh, the hex tool, the Torque T6 and T8 on the end of the hex tool, it appears. This thing, and, and a spudge tool, which you'll need for, for prying open some of the stuff. And the spudge tool is plastic. It looks like it, it's plastic, so it, it's probably not going to last that long. But here's everything. All the screws and everything that come with it. Um, so that's pretty cool. I got it for $10.50. There were others that were cheaper, $5, $6. But most of them were from China or from people that were drop shippers and they're not reliable. But here's the SATA connection I was telling you about. Hopefully this it will fit. I assume it does. This is supposed to be the longer one. A lot of people were saying, no, this will not fit. And this one guy was like, yes, this is the one. They're wrong. They're wrong. Don't trust them. Here's the logic board removal tool. Don't know what that's used for other than moving the logic board, but I don't know how you use it. Spudger, very light, very cheap. And another thing is, is that, yeah, this was, was a little bit higher than some of them, but it was the only one from America. The only one that was selling them from America that I could find that actually had positive feedback for it. But yeah, this is awesome. I'm very pleased with it so far. Uh, I read some reviews on the SATA cable actually failing after one to three months, one to six months, very short, because it's not officially made by Apple, it's made in China. And this budget tool I've read doesn't last that long, so it's just, this thing is basically going to be hit or miss, and you know what, uh, just as long as it works, I'll be happy. It was, it was cheap. Here I began um, to take everything out. The tools worked so far up to this point. I was very shocked and I was very happy at the same time that they worked up to this point. Here everything was taken out. Every tool worked. I had some spare parts that came with it, like spare screws that didn't go anywhere else. So I'm very happy that this worked. And my SSD loaded up, boot drive, and it was great.